Are you ready to hear the best advice in the world? Come watch the video. <laughs> What's going on guys? Welcome to another video. Hope you're having an amazing Thursday so far. Or whatever day you're watching this, video should be coming out Thursday, but hey, go watch this video whenever, okay? So, today's topic, taking notes. To me, the best thing an entrepreneur, anybody actually, can do. Taking notes, holy, holy shit, guys. Taking notes will change your life. It will change your life. Oh, I'm excited about this one. I, I feel like I'm excited for every video. You know why I get excited for every video? Because I love what I do. I love what I do, and I want to share it with you guys. This right here, taking notes, this tool right here, the best thing ever, the most valuable asset I have. This little notebook, dollar store notebook. I think I spent a dollar on this, okay? The best the most valuable piece of anything I have, okay? That sounded really weird, piece of anything I have, no. The most valuable thing I own right now. And just listen, okay. So, I carry this notebook and this pencil with this elastic band, you can't even see that, everywhere I go. It's always in my pocket, it's always in my bag, it's always readily accessible if I need it. And I use it a lot. My whole thing and why I started doing this because I would be outside, I would be at a restaurant, I'd be with friends, wherever it was, and I would get an idea. And I just personally, I hate writing notes and stuff like that on my computer. I hate digitizing it. I like it written down just so I can refer back to and like drawing arrows and random stuff here. Like you can't do that on the computer. So something like a notebook is perfect for me. And at first I didn't think I would use it a lot, but literally, I've used it so many times, whether you're out, someone's like, hey, do you got a, you, got, you have a piece of paper, you got one, whether it be you put it in the back, you write some scrap notes there, whatever it is, but it's just the fact that you always have it with you, especially if you can't have your phone with you, because some places you're not allowed to have the phone, whether like, I don't know if you're, I don't, I'm trying to think of an example where you can't have a phone, like it's 2018, but like, wherever it is, like, I'm sure like you could write something down quickly in your little notebook, and it's a pencil, what are they going to yell at you for that? No, like. Wherever it is, because it's not your, I don't know, that, that, I don't know where I was going with that. Another reason why I like using a notebook instead of a phone, besides the ability to like create it my own way with the freedom of like blank piece of paper and a pencil, is the fact that there's no distractions. Because when I look at my phone, there's always notifications, there's always something that I'm always tempted to look at. But if you don't give yourself that, if you have that million dollar idea, you're not going to forget it because you can get right down into writing it. You, you can go right for it, there's no distractions, and you can even think about it. And it's like, you're not gonna get a text message from your mom, you're not gonna get a new, so when your, your crush on Instagram like your photo, you're not going to, because you won't see that, you deal with that later. Focus on the one thing at a time, the important thing, because obviously it's important, because you're writing it in your, your million dollar notebook right here. And then my whole thing, write down literally everything, especially when starting out, you like, I think I should have this for dinner, or I need to buy this next week, whatever it is, or you write down, this would be a great idea, whatever it is, write it down, and over time, you're gonna figure out what deserves and what needs to go in here, and what other things you'll remember later, or you're just like, I don't need to write it down in here, because to me, I've been through multiple notebooks like this. This is like my, this is getting to the good stuff. So I, I write down a select few things in here. And I like, these are the select few things. It's not the small little things that are like irrelevant in a way. You keep it, keep it a priority. This is, this is my million dollar notebook right here. This, this tiny little thing here is gonna make me, like this is my million dollar notebook. And now that you have written down all these notes, like you gotta take action, which like, <laughs> that I always say that it's always another topic which it is like, I need to I, I can talk more about that but basically oh brain fart oh shit oh shit yes sorry so now that you have them written down you need to like take action so I look at I relook at these every day or after I write it I'll look back at it I'll look back at it once a week once a month I'm just I always refer back to it because it's always in paper I can always flip to any page in my book and read it I can look on 
January 29th, this is what happened, or whatever it is, you can always refer back to it because it's here, and look at it, and you might look at that idea a hundred times before you do something with it, but whatever it is, at least it's there, and it's always gonna be in the back of your head. Get yourself a little notebook, get yourself a pen, a pencil, marker, whatever you like to write with, and keep this always with you, because you never know when you are gonna have a million dollar idea. Yeah. Peace out, guys. <laughs>